What's up peeps? Welcome back to another episode of Road to the Stage. This could be the last episode of Road to the Stage. Oh my god. Sounds so surreal and crazy just saying that. Last episode. But today is show day and it is now 5.30 a.m. and I know I still have crazy bedhead, so it's okay though, it's okay. We're all family here. We don't care what we look like. Um, so I said I'd come in here and just talk about my weight and show you what we're looking like before I wash off this second base coat. So I stood on the scales today because I've been going to toilet all through the night, which is a good thing, which means I dried out even more overnight. So I'm looking tighter and drier. And I weighed my lowest weight of this entire prep, 172 pounds. Um, I think yesterday morning, which was the day before the show, it was, what was it, 174 and a half pounds. So I literally dropped two and a half pounds by doing that no carb day and flushed out all that extra water. So any carbs that go into there now is really going to help and just shuttle into the muscles and go into all the right places where exactly what we want. And it's gonna definitely gonna be a way better look than what I brought to the show two weeks ago, which is just gonna be insane because a lot of people have said like, you know, how can you even better that? Like, where did where are you gonna pull the body fat from? But you know, we did it. I had I had places to pull it from for sure, and I'm very very happy with this look. Um, I'm gonna yeah show you in this mirror now. It's a bit ah hit and miss the lighting and all. But I'll do my best to show you uh, what we're looking like. Or maybe I can show you some of it here as well. That's what... Of... You see that? That's what the abs are looking like and, and the colour. Um, you know, and I'll flip it around and see what... Will the mirror do me any justice? Yeah, so here's what the colour is looking like now. And remember... <laughs> Waist is very, very tight. You can see abs really, really deep, separated. Exactly what you want. And that's the goal to keep it like that on stage. Now everything else, like I look super flat. Like remember that I had no carbs yesterday and barely any water. And like obviously I'm gonna be as flat as a pancake. Like, but today, now we get the carbs going in and a little bit of salt on each meal. It's going to help fill out the muscles and it's going to make me look more vascular and that along with the salt I'll be eating and the simple carbs, you know, I'm going to look completely different by the time I go stand on stage and pump up and all. But yeah, it's pretty crazy, 172. Um, that's the way I got down to last year for the photo shoot, um, but I look completely different, completely. As you can see the legs, I'll try to show you. Doof. Look at that separation, my peeps. Look at that, absolutely crazy. Now, and this mirror is not doing any justice, I tell you that, because in real life, they look absolutely insane. Yeah, I'm just gonna get meal one set up for you now, and then I'll show you, and I'll try to take you along for as much of this journey as I can today, my peeps, and make it a good one, because we wanna finish strong. Breakfast is served. Claire, what do you have? <laughs> You always Just look the like that. <laughs> this is what I wake up to, my peeps. You see this? Tomato head. Um, uh, my face always looks red in these videos. I don't know why. <laughs> you're, yeah, you're super red, actually. Tomato face. Yeah, that's, I wake up to that and I'm like, whoa, every morning and get a heart he attack. Loves it. <laughs> loves it. And loves it. I love her little strawberry head. <laughs> um, <laughs> She's blending in with the, the pillow there. Yeah. Yeah. Did you have breakfast though? No. No? Why? Do you have that? Oh, I have it with me, yeah. What is it? Same as you. <laughs> oh, you're not oh. eating it now? No, no. It's too early. I need coffees first. Yeah. Well, I have mine. Here we go, peeps. Da, da, da. All my blueberries were gone at home, but we got the banana instead. Oh, there's strawberries on the table. I'm going over and put a little <laughs> strawberry in there, actually. Yep. So we got our oats. We got... Um, the chocolate orange protein. So, oh, Jesus, I forgot the bloody salt. I'm gonna go get the salt and the strawberries 
and then I'm gonna get it into me and that's meal one and we start filling out a little bit my peeps yeah so I have to go get my top coat done then at quarter to nine and I'll check back in if I have a meal before I head down there and I'll show you what that's looking like so yes I'm gonna get this into me now before it goes cold so I shall talk to you later welcome back and we are showered up dressed up just waiting to go get my top coat and be hella jacked and tan then and uh we are about to eat meal number two and i'll show you what it is it is look at that tiny little tupperware my hand is legit bigger than this little box so we got 50 grams of basmati rice and then we got 75 grams of chicken and a little bit of ketchup and it's ice cold which is not going to be that nice the rice being rock solid and early because it was in my little um cooler box keeping fresh but yeah 70 grams some people probably want 75 grams of chicken steam that's like one mouthful but you don't need much protein on show day my peeps like it's not a priority your priority is like filling out the muscles with the carbs and the protein just kind of helps you feel a little bit satisfied and kind of like you know just keeps the carbs lingering around a little bit longer and um yeah that's what we're working with for that and we got i show you what i got out of the hotel room glass bottle peeps we are going posh mode today <coughs> body gown glass and this one is 330 mil so this is handy it's measured out for me now rather than drinking on my big massive two liter york so this is probably what i'll drink for the rest of the day so 150 mil with each meal so not too much water today because the, the goal is to keep the stomach nice and tight and yeah the, remember i said vinnie might be throwing in mcdonald's today to fill out but no that's not the case we're going to keep what stick with what we know if you start throwing in foods that you haven't eaten all prep that could very much go wrong for you and your digestion will get screwed you'll be you could be bloated on stage look watery like it, too much things can go wrong you know that's why you eat the same foods all the time you know what works then you know what's going to digest well and yeah so you're playing with fire if you start doing crazy shit like that and a lot of people do do that mind you like a lot so we keep it all the same and that's how we're going to win so oh yes i'm forgetting the main bloody thing right <sighs> this is the one i've been looking forward to can you guess what it is from the last one the last show there listen like guess you have five seconds right listen to the noise all right have you got it here it is see who got it right da, da, da. rice crispy square mwah, 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 mwah. so excited for that and i'll show you a bite of that when i finish this rice because i know there's a lot of people out there that love watching people eat <laughs> so right i'll be back very soon it's time to face the music da, da, da. Look at that, my peeps. Don't be jelly. We got the Rice Krispie treat. Yes, this is gonna fill the muscles out. I ate the chicken and rice, right? The rice was like ice, rock solid. It was <laughs> rotten. Well, the chicken was okay. That cooler box really just iced it up. But yeah, look, we're getting this bad by now. Oh, oh yeah, the smell that caramel one, all right? Oh my, my heart speeding up. Oh yeah. Look at the wiggling around. That was so good, my peeps. You know, you really need to try this out if you haven't already. Like, <clears throat> people that are in prep or have done cuts will understand, but when you stop eating something for so long and then you eat it again, like, it's literally like a drug. It's so good. Um, just give it a go. Give up eating anything like super nice that you enjoy for just even two weeks, right? Give it a go. And then go and eat that thing that you love. And it just brings a whole new love and enjoyment for it again. Because if you eat it all the time, it's not that great. Like, So you, if you want to experience what I'm feeling now, um, give it a go. And go even further and go months without it. <laughs> but yeah, so good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Right, I won't have you let me watch it all, so I'll see you when I get my 
next meal or when I get my top call, whichever comes first. No, the tan is coming first, so I'll see you after that. Mmm. We are back from getting the top coat on my peeps. No waiting around, it was very fast, very smooth, and I absolutely love this color. It's much better than the last time, I think. Like, the hands don't look as dirty, we're on the money, and uh, I will show you what we're looking like now. Da -da -da. Oh, yeah. Yep, we are looking super tight, deep, very deep lines separated, look at that, a lot of detail shown there, very, very, very sharp, yeah, very happy with this colour, absolutely delighted, and I feel 100% on the money, and just keep this look now, going into the show, and I'm about to eat my third meal which i will show you what that is it's six rice cakes with some peanut butter and jam and a little bit of salt and i will show you that when it's all made up and then we got 200 ml of water but i might actually make a coffee out of that instead and that way it'll help me keep going wee wee throughout the day to flush out more water but yeah definitely feeling a little bit dehydrated now because obviously water is kept very low and yeah we haven't got much water today but that's what's going to give us that nice dry hard look and that's what we want and to be honest a lot, a lot of people are already after saying i'm going to be the most conditioned person on stage so i really do have my eyes on that overall for today and that would be a bloody dream come true i'm speaking into existence now so please world give me this overall and I will be forever grateful and make my dreams come true because that's something I definitely would have never expected never expected to win a show let alone an overall so yes um yeah I'll show you when when I make up the stuff and kind of talk through the layout of the show for this one because it's much better than the last one I feel just the layout of it the timing of it all but yeah I'll go through that when I make this up and I shall see you then and we are on to the third meal of the day, my peeps. This one I'm really buzzing for. We got six rice cakes. As you can see, I have them nicely lined up to perfection. And we got jam and one, and peanut butter on the other, and lightly salted. And we got our coffee there with 150 ml of water. So, you wanna see a bite? God, I'm so excited for this jam one. My hands are shaking with excitement. Look at that. Such basic thing, but heaven. Oh. I've got addicted to jam on this prep. Not that I, cause only on the high carb days I had it on the bagels. And now I'm just obsessed with it. And I put it on my oats on them high carb days too. So I'll definitely be eating it all the time on the bulk now. Oh yeah. Yep. A1. So this will help fill me out a little bit more and then we will head down to the show soon enough. And there I will have the half a bag of jellies that I showed you earlier on. And a handful of crisps and another ice crispy bar half an hour before we pump up. So that's the goal and that will help you know give that nice full pumpy crazy vascular look on stage the jellies the sugar the salt all that type of stuff and um yeah as far as the timing of the show is going it's really good this time around i'll be out very early so in get my trophy back out burger mode let's fucking go baby so this is how it's going i'm on about quarter to one right and then there's another over 90s or under 90s, I can't remember. And then 
like there's a, a like a break between you know uh, what do they call it intersection inter intervals what's it called yeah. interval where they, t they take a break and then they go straight in then and do the overalls and present the trophies which is very good so us bodybuilders then don't have to hang around for all the other classes like men's physique the women's bikini all that crack we can just head off and eat so like the overall is usually at the very end of the show like last whereas we're actually on very early today which is good so that's if i get into the overall i have to win my class first but yeah eyes on the prize i'm gonna get this in me now and the next time i'll check in with you then is well probably after the show after my class and i'll let you know how i got on and see that i get into the overall so wish me luck my peeps and i'll see you on the other side <laughs> Let's go, Steve. Stem quad, Steve. Come on. You have to work for it. Let's get it. Well on, okay, Steve. Yeah. Give yourself a little bit of space. Front double biceps. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Steven. Well on, Steve. Off. Keep the legs tight, Steve. Come on. That's it. Five chest. Good, Steve. Good, man. That's it. Five, five, this is your shot. Come on. Yes. yes. Suck it in. Come on. Okay, you want to face the back, please? Back, double biceps. Get Mix them the clips. Clips. Yes. There you go. Go on, Steve. Squeeze it again. Come on, glutes. Squeeze the glutes now. Uh, yes. Another shot of yours, Steve. Come on. Suck Squeeze. it in. That's it. Yes. Yes. Come on. It's yours, Steve. Come on. Yes. Excellent speed. Get them gloves out. Yes. Good. Hold it. Excellent speed. And the winner, uh, the under 80 kilo national champion for 2022.